So, this video took hours to make. This uh, explains why Lego. We usually play the official stuff. So, we've got this train with some weird horns, whatever that means. Ah! Ah! Yeah, you're not gonna scream. Oh! Ah! Uh, okay. Put this will be going to change this file setup. Fuck. This, this is based off Choo Choo Charles. Oh, scary, scary. The set calls it Big Train Charlie because this is a parody. Wait, what? But if the creator ever wanted to work with official Lego, I would buy it. I would want to get that too. They couldn't, but you know. No, not a Lego, but uh, first let's put the train, the wheels on. What about of course, spider webs? We all know Choo Choo Charlie. What do you mean? He's just a regular train. No, oh, oh, God. The worst part of our set was um, it kept falling apart very easily. You can tell this is for display only. You can't do too much of them, and then it'll, it'll, you know, it's uh, your Merkel is the genius. He's just like new. What? Yeah, that's funny. Okay, now get me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not. I'm not playing yeah. with him just for a second. So just you fucking Charlie. Well, I mean, as well. Long time, but uh, well, yeah. so just Charlie. He's got lots of excess. Must be for like drinking the piss. Show a fans it. Just run it on my arm. Run on my arm. The wheels are actually really good for a Lego bootleg. Sometimes you just forget about out uh a oh, Lego. I'm gonna put some wheels on. You sometimes forget about Lego bootlegs, Lego pieces, and how realistically um. We'll fix the spider positions after we put them on. Yeah, I've watched a few top 10 like satisfying Lego pieces. You guys have seen that where we did with a bush tail. I don't know. I think clipped and on stuff can be satisfying if it's not painful or really annoying. Yeah, like clipping these on is pretty fun. Like, uh, I thought of get since me and James are kind of a Lego channel, I thought of getting each one of our pieces and stepping on them and testing them and how badly hurt. I don't know. I don't know why. That's far be fun. I also, Five o'clock shadow. Ugh. I don't support self armor, of course. It is just meant to be a joke, of course. Nothing's going to be taken serious. Well, I'm making. So, uh, we're also planning on getting a, a Lego, um, a Lego version of the train you ride on the in the game. If you uh, play with Star Wars. You fight the cult? Yeah. Because <coughs> everything in the evil it's a It's a trio, and I only got two. The last one felt, uh, we need this. It didn't connect to a theme. It was just a scary Thomas one. It just didn't look as good as the others. The neck just looked too long. The face okay. was too... Uh, yeah, I tried to put each one in the post. So, you've got all the spoopy legs. Oh, scary. Yeah. I'm going to the basics for the post. Yeah, no offense. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, first of all, pretty cool design. Too, um, sharp. And. That's something I like. No minifigure. They could have gave a cultist. That would be cool. As a nose. You know, nose. Oh, these are actually pretty kind of sharp. A cultist. I prefer it without the legs, but, you know, it, Charlie, you know. If you know something about me, you know I like the name Charlie. Yeah. Ever since Kind of Keen. And it, Charles, his name's Charles. Okay, guys, let's take a look. Wait, let's try again. It's just play a little bit. Jump scare one, and Bye. Hi, I will. Oh, uh, I'm going <laughs> to. But I would rate it 10 out of 10. Like, uh, no joke. I think it's a built in took such a long time, but, but like it has lots of great poseability and shit. Uh, so I think it is a ten out of ten, James. It. But I will mainly be used for display, really, because uh, it was a pain to build. 
Bye, guys.